of solution and power. Mercy land. Arena of solution and power. My name is Mrs. Ukeria Eze from Jos Plateau State. And the woman beside me is my sister. What brought me here? I come to testify the goodness of God upon my life. What God of Prophet Jeremiah or Moto Fufi did in my life. This affliction started 2006. I traveled to my hometown, Enugu. I come back, I did not understand myself again. I cannot walk. I cannot stand. I can't even sleep. Thinking is just a joke, like somebody that had this location. But I never knew that the journey of life have started. I went to different hospital. They checked. They called all sorts of names. Some say it's sore, like sore. Some say it's deep vein thrombosis, which I don't know what that means. I begin to cry, asking God for help because the pain is unbearable. I cannot stand it. The thing is getting worse and worse. And every day is just like a new chapter in my life. And this is how it started. That's all the, the year 2006. The journey of life started. I went everywhere, even to Habal Hospital. There is no answer and there is no solution. Okay, uh, so you mean uh, they diagnose a deep vein thrombosis, is that right, as the cause of your problem? Yes. Okay, can you tell us what do you do for a living and how this very problem affected your daily activities and your family in general? I'm a Ketra. You can imagine seeing a Ketra with a wound and a big bandage on her leg. Nobody will enter into that shop. You can't bear the smell or how the person will look like. Everything scattered. My family, some of them left. I don't know what to do. I don't know who to talk to. But I thank my sister. He is here, but she don't know that I want to testify. She introduced me to Mercy Land, Mercy TV. I saw many things there, and I say, if God can do this, my own is a simple case. Can we put Power. our hands together for Jesus? So last year, my husband came to Mercy Land. He's opportune to get the water of Bethsaida, and he joined the partners. Problem that cannot solve for 12 years. Just joining partner. Today, I'm standing here. Power! Are you clapping for Jesus Christ? I believe that due to what you went through, maybe I would like you to throw some light about what you went through. Is it that the doctor, maybe after prescribing so many drugs to you, did they provide maybe any solution or maybe they said they are going to amputate your leg, something like that? What was their response? When they prescribed this friend kind of drugs, we did everything. In they said that they, I don't have anything to give doctors again. The last solution they gave to me, being last two years, that they will amputate my leg. But I refuse. I say I know the God I serve. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. The God of Prophet Jeremiah or Motufufuyi, which I have been seeing in television, that that God will do it for me. People of God, can we give the Lord a round of applause once again? So you said uh, due to this very problem, your husband came down to Mercy City. And uh, as a partner, 
he received the prayer from the man of God, believing that God Almighty is going to locate you. Because actually he came on behalf of your problem. And it was opportune to have with him the pool of Bethesda water. Can you tell us what happened along the line? I begin to minister the anointing water. I never knew that he's so fast like that. I use, if, if I should talk to somebody or sit and chat with people, I have to take a sachet of painkiller. But I come to notice that in two days, I did not take it. Meanwhile, the bandage is there. I never knew that it's getting dry. I don't think you are excited about this testimony, people of God. Can ah! we jump up on our feet and give this Lord the praise? Wave your hands and give this God the worship. Tell your neighbor, these are the benefits of partnership. Ask your neighbor once again, are you a partner? If yes, tell your neighbor, you've made the right choice. Keep it up. Cheer up. The God of Prophet Jeremiah will continue to surprise you. If you believe that, clap for the Lord once again. So you mean after applying the pool of Bethesda water, that is how God Almighty healed you? Yes, sir. So can you tell us your present state now? What are the things that you can do right now that you couldn't do before? First of all, my husband, what really happened to my husband? He came here. Why I'm saying this is to tell everybody here that whatever you pick here is an instrument. Even the seat you are sitting is an instrument. Never minding who is sitting on top because the man of God has spoken and it must come to pass. My husband picked mud. The day he was in a shop, a neighbor, a next door neighbor. I don't suppose to say this, but I have to testify the goodness of God upon my family. The neighbor bought something from my husband and he dropped a note, thousand naira. After giving him everything, he left. My husband picked the money. Half of his side just paralyzed and he fell down. Nobody is there to help him. He begins to shout, and nobody is coming in. He crew with the left side and went to where he dropped the mud. And he picked the mud and speak and say, God of Jeremiah or mother for free. Enough is enough. I'm not going to take this again. And he chewed that mud, just like Fim, my husband Jacob. Power! I don't think you are ready for your own testimony in this place. Power! Partners of Mercy Television, you are blessed. Because you are partner, a partner of this great commission, you are protected. No weapon fashion against you shall prosper. I don't think you believe what I'm saying because we don't celebrate in Mercy City while sitting. We celebrate in Mercy City by jumping. People of God shout hallelujah. Say it once again. Hallelujah. So we'd like to hear once again from you. How is your present condition? Before I can not jump, I can jump. I can run. Power. Are we excited for Jesus? We can see that indeed our sister is healed. And once the Son of God set you free, you are free indeed. And there is nothing the devil can do about that. So, you said you were a caterer before and each time people come into your place, because of that bad odor, they will go. So, how is your presence business now? The God of Jeremiah, I know he has started it. And wherever God visited, that home is made home. People of God, celebrate Jesus once again. Yeah. 
Yes, we thank God Almighty for what he has done in your life. And what word of advice can you give to people out there watching you right now who are not yet partners of Mercy Television? The advice I will give to my fellow brothers and sisters is a partner, just a partner. The problem of 12 years solved. What doctors and natives cannot do, just a month's partner and it's said to partner with God, the author and the finisher, the beginning and the end, the one that knows you. No matter what is happening in your life, he is able, he will do it when that time comes. People of God celebrate Jesus once again. Power! Hallelujah. The Lord is good. So let's hear some few words from your sister beside you. Uh, Madam, you're very much welcome. Can you tell us your name and what can you say about what the God of Prophet Jeremiah has done in the life of your sister today? Mercy land. Mercy land. I run out of solution and power. Christ, mercy land. I run out of solution and power. By name, my name is Mrs. Chidima Cyril Obe. I'm from Plateau State, Joss. This is my sister, as she said. I was the one that introduced her to Mercy TV. One day, he was passing. I met her with a bandage on her leg. I said, sister, what happened to your leg? He said, just like that. Too. I said, there is a solution. I have God of a woman, woman. The only man that can able to proud of. The only man who can heal when that ugly situation. I said, go and register and be a partner to Mercy Television. Surprisingly, her husband went and got registered to be a partner. After sprinkling the, the pool of Bethesda water to this leg, that's how this leg got vanished. Power! People of God, can we make it louder to the Lord God of Prophet Jeremiah Omoto for fame? Yes, we thank God Almighty for what he has done. And uh, Ma, we want to encourage you to be ruled by God's word because this is the only way to maintain your blessing. And as you made up your mind to be a partner of Mercy Television, we believe that this is just the beginning. More testimony uh, to be revealed into your life in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. People of God, can we celebrate Jesus once again? Alors, nous remercions le Seigneur pour la vie de cette femme aujourd'hui, chers réalisateurs guéris de la thrombose. Alors, cette femme, pratiquement depuis 12 ans, fut affligée par cette maladie. Alors, les médecins ont même révélé qu'il devait amputer sa jambe. Alors, elle a dit ceci a vraiment affecté ses activités quotidiennes, au point elle avait vraiment du mal à vaquer à ses occupations quotidiennes, ses activités quotidiennes. Elle était euh, cuisinière euh, par profession et tel qu'elle a relaté, cher Tessateur, vraiment, euh, vraiment une odeur très nauséabonde dégagée de sa jambe. Ceci affectait vraiment ses clients. Alors, euh, elle a dit, euh, dû à ce fait, elle était vraiment bouleversée. Euh, mais gloire soit rendue à Dieu du fait que son mari, qui était partenaire de Merci TV, a décidé de venir à Merci City pour recevoir la prière de l'homme de Dieu. Il a décidé également de s'en procurer de l'eau de la piscine de Bethesda qui il a juste béni sa femme avec de cette eau et appliqué effectivement sur cette partie indiquée et ceci a vraiment procuré une guérison vraiment instantanée dans la vie de cette femme aujourd'hui sa jambe qui devait être amputée par le passé a été totalement reformée cette plaie très très ouverte qui était vraiment révélée aujourd'hui le Seigneur l'a complètement guéri alors elle peut maintenant marcher librement pouvant vaquer à ses situation quotidienne elle n'a plus de douleur elle est ici aujourd'hui pour remercier le Seigneur pour cette œuvre miraculeuse dans sa vie à travers le partenariat. Apposons pour le Seigneur. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus.